<laughs> so guys, I'm super excited. Today is our day 14. That means my babies are clocking two weeks today. And guess what? No more brooding, no more heat, no more space restriction, no more air tightening of the room. So guys, we are stopping our brooding today. So guys, I'm super excited. Now, first thing we'll be doing, now, first thing we'll be doing, we are removing this guy. This guy that tries for me so much. This brooding guy. We are removing this brooding guy. Uh, this is the first thing we are going to do. Guys, check out. <laughs> now, after breathing, bed needs a lot of space. Well, a girl that needs a lot of space. They need space to grow. They need space to express, they express themselves. They need space to do speed. They need space to run around, as you can see. They are already running around. Now, the good thing about this is that we've not had any mortality. No one has paid her fair deal. Guys, two weeks of clothing, no mortality, no despair and fair deal. So, what we did now, now I'll show you guys what to do immediately after clothing for two weeks. Now, use your stock sense. If the weather is too hot, stop your clothing within one week. Now, if the weather is too cold, you can extend your breathing. Your breathing. I was using your stock sense. So, what we did now, we are going to be cleaning up here, bringing in fresh little material for them. Now, just follow me along. So now, let's clean up this place immediately. Immediately. We are cleaning up here. We force it to... As you can see, it's very bad. This is... The can is too bad. And it's not good for the face. So guys, we are done. Sorry, we are done removing the little material. Now the next thing is, we are still doing bushing. Please, at this stage, yes, they are done using, they are done using um with a bushing. Bushing quite very expensive. So what we are still using bushing. So after this week, we will stop using bushing. We will move to um sawdust. So I'm going to stop with these guys. Now, as you can see, my bed are enjoying themselves. Now, they're like perfect time I feel Now, the next thing to do, remember, you clean up immediately, you remove your um, breathing guard. You remove your breathing guard, sorry. You remove your breathing guard, you clean up the lid, the lid, perfect time I feel Then you apply new fresh one. Then the next thing, my antidote. See, I don't miss out of this. You see this? I don't miss out of this. Now, Chaco, I'll still explain it, I'll still explain it every day. Now, then the Chaco works as an antibiotic. It helps to flush out your brothers, their system. It, 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 it resists your, uh, this thing, little material to smell. And it, it, um, what's it called? It helps to avoid flies and little material. It helps to avoid your little material to smell. So, you just apply a little bit. Yeah, nice marks so, so, so guys, we get more done with this. And the next thing we do is, let's try and stir it together. So. Guys, 
The next thing, you're trying to reach our light source. Now, you'll be putting it at the middle. Yeah, we'll put it at the center. Just that the light will emanate everywhere. Okay, now, when the green light, it will be spread everywhere. So, the next thing now is, we yeah, are bringing in our, what's it called? The next thing we are bringing our drinker. The next thing we are bringing our drinker and our feeder. Now, remember, we are just using three, three, three feeder, three feeder and three drinker. Now we are making it four drinker and four feeder. Now we want these guys to fit very well. Yeah, we want them to fit very well. So, you just, now this is one, this is two. So, guys, remember, our feeder is ready. Now, remember, we are using, we are using during fluting, we use only three feeder. Now we are using four feeders. With time, we keep increasing it. Okay? Yeah, with time, we keep increasing the feeder and the drinker. So, instead of keeping the drink on the, the feet on the ground, now we are suspending it here. It's called high feet. So, if we don't want these guys to waste feet, we don't want them to waste feet, sorry. We don't want these guys to waste, keep on wasting feet for us. Now, uh, the next thing is our height adjuster for the water. Now, the weather in, uh, in Abuja, Nigeria, the weather is very hot. Guys, the weather is very hot. So these guys need a lot of water. A lot, like, when I mean a lot of water. Remember, before we were just using two height adjuster. But now we are using, we're using three. Three for each drinker. So we are facing one here. Just add it. One here. One here. One here. One here. Yeah, that one here. Making it five drinker for them. Making it five drinker. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, making it five drinker. Now, the essence of making it three drinkers, we want it to be on the top level or on the back level. Mind you. Sorry. This is bringing our water. So, guys, now because of the stress, we we'll stress these guys, you can see the way we we'll stress them. Now, we added multivite to the water. Multivite helps to boost their feeling behavior and also help to ease the stress they've gone through. That's why it's very important on day one of arrival. Give them, either give them multivite, glucose, or coconut water. So, we flip over. Yeah. Drop the wine here yeah, for them. So, eat the second one. You just eat it for them. And drop for them. This is a stall drinker. Now, the weather is very hot, dry and dusty. These guys need a lot of water to dehydrate themselves. They need a lot of water to dehydrate themselves. The fourth one. The fourth one is this guy. The last one. So guys, as you can see these guys, these guys are enjoying themselves. Cool. Now there's enough space for them to play around. There's enough space for them to do space. There's enough space for them to distribute their print oil. There's enough space for them to, you know, freedom. Freedom for everything. Guys, now we are done with our breeding. No more heat, no more breeding, no more air with air restriction, no more space restriction, no more air tight in the room. These guys are good to go. Now, let me show you their weight at week two. Week two of brooding. 
we too. Let me show you that weight. These guys are doing awesome. Now, yesterday we weighed them. We are getting up to 400 and something grams. Now, let's check their weight for today. Okay, now. Now, you're going to be checking their weight. And please. If you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please, please do a like and subscribe. Now, let me show you guys something. Now, on the day, I, I, I won't be summarizing from day one to let me just start from from week, week seven. Sorry, day seven, sorry. Now, on the day seven, we will weigh their weight. We got 173 grams. Now, one bag. Day eight, 256 grams. It's very important. Check the weight of your bed every day to know if they are growing or not. To know if they are growing or not. Now, on the day 9, we check their weight, we are getting 261 grams. Now, on the day 10, we check their weight, we are getting 303 grams. Now, on the day 11, we didn't check their weight, I was quite very busy that day, so I forgot to check their weight. Now, on the day 12, we check their weight, 400, 400 grams. Now, yesterday, which is day, which is day 13, we check their weight, 464 grams. Now, let's check their weight today to know if they will reach 500 grams at week 2. 500 grams. So, guys, let's check it out. What is the weight of this guy? So guys, you are getting 400 and, 482 grams. 482 grams. 482 grams. So now the next one. This guy is weighing. So guys, this guy is weighing 500 and 540, 543 grams. Sorry, 543 grams. Now let's check another one. So this guy is weighing, this guy is weighing 500 and 551 gram, 551 gram. 5 so this guy is weighing 500 and 548 grams 548 grams 548 grams so guys we are done with this guys now what we are getting here is the first one we got 482 grams, 543 grams, 551 grams, 548 grams. Guys, we are doing awesome. So, guys, this is what we do at exactly two weeks, day 14 of breathing. We break it at day 14. Now, the weather is very hot. Now, that it's scattered everything at day 14. Now, if the weather was cool, I would have extended my breathing. Now, the weather is quite very hot. So, like, so guys, we did awesome. My bed are doing well. We've not had any mortality, no mortality. My bed has still 100 and so guys, this is awesome. Now we are going with 551 gram. Now 551 gram. 0.515 kg. Two bags. No, sorry, we end up three bags today. Three bags, 102. We give them motivate. No number nothing. So guys. We are doing awesome. We are doing wonderful. Now, please, if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do well and ask subscribe, okay? Shame and that's your favorite good from a God Boy, the Kelly Scraper. Guys, we are done. Just take a look at my bed. Take a look at my babies. They will just enjoy themselves, play around, just bait, create more distribution, do everything they want to do. So, guys, thank you so much.